Hi there, it's Martha and I'm so excited for this video. This is a special video. Uh, I got this big box, this arrived. This big, very heavy box is full of wax and um, it arrived yesterday. So I'm part of a round robin here in the wax community that started with Erica Kane and then it went to Catherine King and I will list everyone's channels and everyone's video that has already received this box. This box has been all over the country. Uh, and then after Catherine, it went to Susan Fitzpatrick. And then from Susan Fitzpatrick, it went to Carrie from Carrie's Collections. And then from Carrie, Carrie sent it over to Brittany from Brittany Joyce. Uh, and then Brittany sent it over to Ashley Overly. And then Ashley has sent it to me. So that's so far who's received this box. And then it's still, we still have April. I'm looking at my notes here so I don't forget anyone. Then April Lee, April Lee the Wax Queen and Christine from Christine Sensing and Valerie Schupman and Maggie JL, Maggie Lamb. Uh, her channel is Maggie JL. Again, I'll list everything in the description box along with any videos that have already 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 been published and shown as far as uh, this box goes. So the idea is that I go through this box here and I can keep what I want to keep and I'll have like a guess pile. I have my baskets here. I have a maybe pile and then I have a not for me pile and maybe this is something that someone else would enjoy. And, and then at the very end, it'll go back to Erica who started it all. So I'm a uh, very somewhat undecisive when it comes to scents. So there may be more in my maybe pile. Uh, and then I'll just kind of go back and decide. Um, but the whole idea is that we're sharing wax with each other. So whatever I take out, I want to make sure that I put just as much back in for the next person. Um, and that we're sharing what we love and, you know, hoping that the next person will find something in here that they love as well. So it's a great way to also try vendors you haven't tried or um, most of us do purchase a lot of Scentsy. Uh, some, I think Ashley wasn't as much into Scentsy. So it's a nice mix of everything. I'm just kind of newer into discovering vendor wax. So that's also a, just a great, this is a great opportunity to kind of just try things I've never tried. So let's get started. Okay. Um, Wow, there's so much stuff here. I don't know what to do with this box. Let's see, should I put it on my lap? I don't know if this is gonna work. <laughs> it's kind of cumbersome, but let's see if I can squeeze in here uh, and do this. Maybe it's better here. Maybe it's better here. It's better here, okay. All right, this smells so good. Okay, this is Country Scents Handcrafted and it looks like it's called Beach Vacation. Never heard of this vendor. Um, I'm gonna try to do quick sniffs and kind of initial impressions. Okay, this smells good. It's nice and beachy, oopsie, and I don't wanna make a mess. You know what, it's crumbling, so I'm not gonna, I'm gonna leave it in its camp clamshell. I have a habit of trying to pull stuff out. It smells really nice and beachy. I'm going to, I'm gonna probably pass it on. It's a nice scent, but I'm, I'm you know, I can't keep everything. Um, then we have, it's my birthday from L3 Waxy Wonders. I I like L3, I have not smelled the scent. Mm, that smells good. What is this? So this is, let's see here if I can, I didn't bring my glasses. This is fresh picked, I should have brought my glasses. Fresh picked strawberries, coconut, buttercream, and frosting white cake. This smells really nice. I am picky about strawberry and I'm picky about L3 strawberry. Some I like and some I don't. So I'm gonna put this in the maybe pile. I'm gonna kind of sniff that one some more. This is Strax Acid Bath. This is also from L3. And this is Boogie Be Gone Peppermint Rosemary Mint. Uh, and that is that. I do like mint. Oh, this is such a big box. Oh my gosh. Oh, I do like this minty, minty and rosemary. 
That's different. That's different. So again, I'm probably, I'm, everything's going to go in the maybe pile. I, that that might be a, a yes, but I, I'm one of those that I want to see everything first and then make my decision. Um, L3 Waxy Wonders Orange Chiffon Cake. Orange Chiffon Cake. Mm, this is good. Okay. This is really good. I love kind of orange and lemon and, and it's it's nice and that chiffon. So that's a guess. That's definitely. Uh, cardamom pumpkin pecan waffles smoked vanilla. And from L3. Ooh, this is different. Mmm. Okay. I may take, all right, I think I think this is a yes. I think that's a yes. Um, strawberry lemonade from Ebony Violet. This is sweet strawberries and tart lemonade. And this is a souffle. It definitely get the lemon. So if you like lemon and strawberries together, this is really nice. I almost get like a little fizziness or something to it. But again, I'm just really picky with strawberries and I have a few strawberry um, vendors or strawberry blends from vendors that I'm going through. So I'm gonna put that in the no pile. Snow Kingdom, this is from R3. This is Candy Cane's Cool Peppermint, Vanilla Bean Noel, Vanilla Ice Cream and Musk. And this is Snow Kingdom. I do love a good peppermint. I love peppermint. Ooh, this is minty, cool. That's that's a good mint. I'm gonna put that in the maybe pile. What I might do with this is take a few, not the whole bag, but take a few for myself and then can let someone else enjoy more of that. Um, then we have Lightning, lighting the menorah from L3 Waxy Wonders. And this is, I don't know what the scent notes are of that. I can't really tell what this is. There's maybe a hint of something a little smoky but I can't really tell what this is. This one is not really for me, so I'm gonna pass that along. Then we have Snickers Latte Salted Caramel Sugared Shortbread Sugar Milk Zucchini Bread. <laughs> That's a lot. Um, Snickered Latte Salted Caramel, this sounds good. That does smell good. Very creamy. The caramel's not too strong, which I like. I like caramel, but I don't like it too, too strong. So I'm gonna put this in the maybe pile. Then we have from uh, Vintage Chic. This is Summertime Sadness, Fresh Strawberry Ice Cream Summer Scoop Type. So Vintage Chic, I've never ordered from her. I know she's, I think, uh, closing her shop this, this year. Yeah, this strawberry is not for me. It's more of a, there's some strawberries that to me are kind of like maybe tart or something. I'm not sure. Um, layered macaroon. Uh, this is from Ebony Violet. This one doesn't, it smells pretty. I'm just not getting a whole, I'm just not really getting a sense of it. So I'm gonna put this in the no pile. Then we have Jelly Beans Wild Berry Mousse Waffle Cone. And that's from L3. That smells nice. That smells really good. I'm gonna put this in the maybe pile. I'm sorry. <laughs> the Perfect Pear from L3 Waxy Wonders. And 
It's a pretty pair. It's definitely pear, but I like pear blended mostly with other things. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna pass this on. And then we have cinnamon sugar from L3 Waxy Wonders. That's good. It's just like a nice sweet cinnamon sugar. That's exactly what it smells like. Mm. That might be good for like even blending it with some other pastry. I'm going to put that in maybe. Then we have Cupcakes at Tiffany Jet Puff Mallow Sugar Cookie. And this is from L3 Waxy Wonders. I'm just going to take one of these out. Mm, I love bakery. Now Cupcake at Tiffany's is like a chocolate cupcake, I think. Um, and I like this puff mallow and the sugar cookie. I'm not getting a lot of Cupcake at Tiffany's, which is good. I don't want it to be too much. That's a nice one. So I, I, I'm going to put it in the maybe for now. There's so much in here. So I'm just like, uh, okay, this one is for, this is a gift. This is gifted. Oh, these are all, let me take these out. These were special requests. Um, then we have the Philadelphia story from vintage cheek. And this is rich pistachio pudding cake topped with spun sugar, frosting and ripe strawberries. Yeah, this is good. It's um, definitely getting the kind of the more the pistachio, which I do like pistachio. I've just never had it, I think, with strawberry. And I've never tried vintage cheek. So I may, I may, I'm going to put this in the maybe pile just to give it a try. Um, perfect pumpkin. This is very, very light. I really, I'm not picking up on much. I'm going to put this in the no. Um, peppermint pine cones, uh, peppermint candy, pine cones, and Twinkies from K's. Mm, nice and minty. I'm not really getting a lot of pine cone. Okay, now it's coming. It's coming through. That's a nice one. It's a nice one, but I think I'm going to pass it along. Um, this is brownie batter coffee bean coconut cream pie from L3. Mmm. This is definitely this bakery. I'm definitely getting that brownie batter with a coffee. Mmm. I'm going to put this in the maybe pile, but that is a, that's a good one. Um, cherry chip cake, Peeps pink frosted cake. That's a nice cherry one. Uh, I definitely get the cake. Um, I'm going to say maybe, but that's probably going to turn into a yes. <laughs> um, one of the good ones, uh, this looks like it's from Rose Girls. Mm, okay, let's see. This smells very clean and fresh. It smells nice. It smells good. Okay, this might be a maybe. Then we have Eight Crazy Nights. So I have this one, I believe. I'm pretty sure I have this one. Yeah, I think I do have it in the sample I got. This is a good one. I'm going to pass it along just because I already have this one. This is, uh, geez, I really should have brought my glasses. Um, I can't tell what the vendor is, but it's, um, oh, Traver okay, Traverse City Wax Company, and this is soy blend wax melts. It says banana, nectarines, strawberry, pineapple, and almonds with a hint of jasmine. Never tried 
Is it Traverse, Traverse City or Traverse? I think it's Traverse City. Um, okay, this one, I get the nectarines. I get the banana. I'm gonna, this is good. I'm gonna pass it along only because I'm not super big on banana and then strawberry as well. So I'm gonna pass this along to someone who likes strawberries and banana. Um, this is Peeps Yellow Cake Jelly Beans from L3. I do have some of this as well. So I think I'm just gonna pass this along. Yeah, it's a nice one. It's a good one. I have some of this already. Um, Falling for You. This looks like it's Rose Girls Blueberry Cheesecake cider donut and dunk my donut and it's a pumpkin shape that smells really good i love false scents too um blueberry cheesecake though i'm not sure about cheesecake i haven't tried hers um so i'm gonna put this in the maybe pile I haven't tried her cheesecake. I really haven't tried any cheesecake <laughs> blends. Um, then we have Back from the Grave. This is Cedar, Pine, Bonfire, and Sandalwood. And it's also from Rose Girls. Hmm. I like this. I like cedar. I like pine. I like woodsy scents. It's a little smoky. And I don't have a lot of it right now, so I think I, I think I'm going to keep that one. We have vintage chic. There's no place like home, and it's pumpkin pumpkin pecan waffles. This is really light. Hmm. I do get more of the pecan, I think, than I get the, or the waffle, than I get the pumpkin. Um, I'm going to pass it along. Let's see. Then we have the pharmacist's daughter, and this is a barn dance, and it is notes of I'm going to get my glasses. I'm like, what am I thinking? All right, I'm back. Let's see. Okay, this is much better. Barn dance. This is barnwood, hayride, red apples, cinnamon, and cloves. And this is from the pharmacist's daughter. Ooh, that's interesting. It's a really pretty fall scent. Hmm. Okay, this I'm going to put in the maybe pile because it's different from anything I think I have right now. Then from Zape, I've never tried Zape either. This is Santal Armand, Armandel, I think. I've been really curious about Zape. Hmm, that's nice. I think Santal is like sandalwood, right? That's nice and creamy. Um, um, maybe, but leaning toward yes. Vanilla Waves. I've never smelled this before. I've heard a lot about it. I've heard a lot about it. I'm so glad I get to smell it now. Okay, so it's it's like vanilla, but it's like, like a salty vanilla. Um, Most likely, yes, but I'm going to put it in the maybe pile for right now. And then from the Bathing Garden Pumpkin Party. Never tried the ba uh, Bathing Garden either. And this is, oh, they put scent notes in the back. Thank you. This is, looks like biscotti, walnuts, brown sugar, and caramel. Um, and she always has these like little cool designs and stuff. I've kind of stayed away just because of, like it's pretty, and I think Ashley might have said this too in her video. It's pretty, but I don't necessarily need all the glitter and like stuff floating in my wax um, warmer. This one's this one's good, um, but I'm picking up walnuts, and I definitely get the brown sugar and a little bit of the cloves. Are clove in here? 
No, there isn't clove. What is it? So it's walnuts, biscotti, brown sugar, caramel. There's something like maybe a clove or something I'm picking up. I'm going to pass this along. Um, that's a gift for somebody. Okay. Then we have beach bonfire in the back roads. This is bergamot, ginger, vetiver, pine, campfire, marshmallow, vanilla lace, and marshmallow fireside from Rose Girls. Hmm. Okay. This is, this is nice. I like this. I like this. Okay. So I'm going to put this in my yes. And we have shamrock shake. This is cream, cream de menthe and vanilla soft serve from L3 Waxy Wonders. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to do a speed round. I think I'm doing pretty good. Ooh, that's kind of nice too. That's interesting. Oh, is it a bunny? It's a bunny. <laughs> um, cream de menthe. This is interesting. This is really interesting. Um, I'm gonna put it in the maybe, but it, it might turn out to be a yes. Cause I don't, I don't think I have anything that's really like a cream de menthe. Ooh, I have never tried second and spruce. I, she had her RTS on Friday and I, uh, and I, I'm, I'm, I was late. I kind of, uh, you know what? I just noticed this is for somebody. This is not for me. So I'm going to not even talk about that. <laughs> There's a name on it. I'm like, ah, it's not for me. Okay. Saltwater goddess. This is a uh, saltwater mermaid goddess of the sea. Copper tone type. I didn't see the name on that one, but anyway, going back to second and spruce, I was able, I, Got on there late. I kind of missed the right when she opened the RTS. So I was able to get a couple things and try it. But um, yeah, it was only like three things because it was it was pretty much wiped out. Mm, saltwater goddess. This is notes. I already said that, right? A mermaid goddess of the sea in copper tone type. This is pretty good. I'm with aquatic. Sometimes, you know, sometimes I like them. Sometimes I don't. What I might do, I don't know. I, I might, she gave, uh, Erica put in extra baggies in here. So if we wanted to not take the whole thing, might take part of this and then give the other part to somebody else. So I'm going to stick that in maybe for now. Kissing in the pink rain. I have tried this one before. This is from Rose Girls. Um, and it was, it was a good one. It was really pretty. I do remember that, but I've tried this one, so I'm going to pass this on. Mango Black Cherry Noel. This is also from Rose Girls. Hmm. I definitely get the cherry and I get the mango. It's kind of a nice blend. Nice blend of both. Um... I'm going, I'm going to pass it along. Christmas PJs. This is downy sugar cookies and blue spruce. This is a laundry scent. Interesting with the um, blue spruce in there. It's like a laundry, get a little touch of the tree note, but not a lot. Nice and clean and fresh. I will put this in the maybe pile. My baby basket. It's, it's quite a lot in there. Um, pumpkin, pumpkin cream. I can't talk. Pumpkin creamer from Sassy Girl Aroma. This is a cozy, creamy blend of cashew creamer, pumpkin puree, brown sugar, and a sprinkle of nutmeg powder. This brittle has seen better days. Oh, this poor box. It's been traveling all over the world, all over the United States. Um, yeah, it smells like I get the cashew creamer. I get the pumpkin, brown sugar. I'm getting all of those notes. 
This is really, really nice, but I think I'm gonna, I think someone else would enjoy this more than I would, so I'm gonna pass it along. I'm so glad I got to smell it though. Then my wish for Christmas, this is freshly baked sugar cookies surrounded by pine and pine cones scented in the fireplace. Also from Sassy Girl Aroma. I'm just gonna take the top, the top half. Oh, this is good. I do like a good tree scent. Definitely get the pine. The pine and the pine cones is definitely coming out. A hint, a hint of fireplace, but not like, it's not really smoky. I think I'm gonna take a little bit of it. Um, I'm not gonna, I don't need the whole brittle, but um, I do like a good wood, wood scent. So I like that one. Hawaiian smoothie. This is sweet pineapple, coconut milk, banana, and vanilla from Sassy Girl Aroma. I'm currently, I have this in my melting basket right now. So I have a whole brittle. Um, it, to me, this one smells, if I remember correctly, uh, like pina colada. Yeah, it's, it's, it's similar to a pina colada kind of scent. But it's very good. I'm enjoying it. But since I already have a whole brittle or part of a brittle, I'm going to pass it along. Tiffany's Sweet Fudge. This is um, from Sassy Girl Aroma. This is cotton candy, cupcakes at Tiffany's, and vanilla butter fudge. Definitely get the um, vanilla butter fudge, the cupcakes at Tiffany's, Ah, oh, that's good. And the cotton candy. Sometimes I struggle picking up on cotton candy. Mostly I'm getting the vanilla butter fudge with some um, cupcake at Tiffany's. I'm, it's a nice scent, but I think we have a lot of bakery lovers in this, um, in this red, uh, red robin, in this round robin. Uh, I'm going to pass that one along. Then Traverse City Wax Company Marshmallow Pistachio Funnel Cake. I love pistachio. So let's see. Mmm, it smells good. I love pistachio. It's like a ice cream. It looks like the top of an ice cream scoop. I really like that. So I love pistachio so much that I'm going to keep that. Ah, this has a note for somebody. I'll put that aside. Okay, we're almost, we're here. We're almost at the end. Satsuma Sour Patch Kids. I have this as well, so I know I'm going to pass this along. Uh, this is a really good scent. Mm, nice and bright. <sighs> like a Satsuma. It's like a, it's a citrusy, like a tangerine. Uh, and that's really good. But I have this, so I'm going to pass that on. And then here we go. We got a big block here. Cookie Christmas Therapy um, from... Uh, L3 Waxy Wonders. And this has scent notes of eggnog, cookie therapy, and a hint of gingerbread, Santa's on keto, pretzel sugared shortbread. I said brick. It's a loaf. It's a big old loaf, and I think I'm gonna take some of it. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm definitely gonna chop a little bit of this and keep some for myself. Um, yeah, definitely get some of that gingerbread, a little bit of pretzel. Ah, yeah, that's good. That is a good one. So that is Christmas cookie therapy and I'm gonna take a piece of it. So I did good. I think I did pretty good. I'm um, trying to keep this. I like my videos to be about no more than 45 minutes or so. Um, and so hopefully that wasn't too fast, but I think if you watch a lot of the red robins some of these are have been in there so you've already heard about them so i did i think i did pretty good i have a i have a couple more in my maybe pile to look through but i will do that off camera so i can just spend a little more time with them um so now is the part where uh i get to pick a name so draw a name from me before you close out your video so i'm going to pick a name and give you a clue but not so much, not like a totally obvious clue because part of the fun is trying to figure it out. Uh, 
We'll see if I can try not to be so obvious. Okay, let's see. Okay. Oopsie. Okay, well, one, well, you know what? I'm like, one fell out, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna close my eyes and pick this one. Okay. Okay, I, I have to put this one back <laughs> because it was Erica and she's the one. She's got to be the final person to get it. Okay, this one jumped out. All right, okay. So this next person, I, I know what clue I'll give. This next person, and maybe it's obvious, um, has been really enjoying Bender Wax lately and she hit a big milestone. That's, that's what I'm going to say. So I've been enjoying chatting with her and I'm really, really happy to be passing on this box. And so that is my clue. Yeah, she hit a big milestone. I think that might be obvious, <laughs> but uh, thank you so much for hanging out. And uh, yeah, that is it. And this has been so much fun. So I hope we do this again for the fall. Um, but it's just a great opportunity for me to try as a newbie to try new vendors and different scents that I've never smelled before. So thank you so much for including me. And again, I will include everyone's channel and video if they've have, if they've already, uh, published one, um, up in the description box. So thank you and have a good day. Bye.